After months of labor talks, the Pike Township School District and their teachers union have finally come to an agreement. This is after several teachers rallies and sick out calls causing class cancellations over the past few months. Fox 59's Mike Sullivan breaks down what both sides agreed to. Sleepless, tedious and contentious. The Pike School Board President used those three words to describe three months of labor negotiations with teachers now that both sides have an agreement. It's a sense of accomplishment. He needed only a few words. And it's a sense of relief. When it comes to the Teachers Association, even fewer. Yes, it is. Absolutely, it's a win. The board unanimously approved the agreement after 90% of the teachers union ratified it on Monday. The deal will raise average annual salaries by more than 5%. It also includes more than a million dollars in stipends and handouts. It helped the middle year teachers. It helped the 5 to uh, 25 year teachers. Yet the contract itself is only for a year. Teachers Association President Chris Ludy saying. This was not a contract that was going to fix all the issues financially for our for our teachers um, but what it will do is give us a first step school board president terry webster admitting we've taken our lumps and our bruises but he believes this experience will ultimately help the school board in future negotiations take the knowledge that we have learned uh, take people serious uh, believe that they're serious believe them and going forward, uh, always put our best foot forward. The grueling months of talks for some school days to be canceled, others going virtual. We won't have too many disruptions uh, and, and that school can, can go on in person because it's, it's certainly crucial. In the end, Ludy had three words of his own, trust, transparency, and communication. And I know everybody wants to work on those three issues. This is their hope for 2022. In Pike Township, I'm Mike Sullivan, Fox 59 News. There will be another round of negotiations in the future. We asked the Teachers Association if they believe there will be any issues then. They said if there are, they will deal with those next year.